is against the 10K Karate Group 2 final coming up for a place in the overall semis. This bout is between Musa Edwards and Dylan Rush. Final group bout, the winner of this faces Jordan Thomas in the semi-final. And you can almost smell that green, Greg. No, you close. can indeed, you can indeed. Whoever it is, I'm going to be their friend at the end of the night. Yeah, Joe didn't lend me a fiver last time. Yeah, that's all right, Joe. Yeah. God bless him. Okay, good, 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 um, good idea from me. So I'm looking to take that first point as quickly as possible. Get that first point. Get in their head. Get control of the fight. That's what he's looking. He's, look, he's looking to do there, Musa. And he's been very confident. He's the smallest man alongside Conor O'Sullivan in that group. Yeah, by a country mile. And he's just, in a way, he's almost like breezed through the competition. He knows his assets. He knows his assets are speed. Speed and dexterity. That's what his assets are. Yeah, that's, so he's used them very well. He's done very well. But Dylan, Dylan, again, we saw him come back. He is a canny fighter. He knows what he's doing. And Moose is going to have to really deal with what I consider to be one of the smarter fighters in the tournament. And you mentioned the learning curve for these athletes and the way they're going. I think for Musa, if he gets through to at least the semi-final stage, it says so much about his future in this sport as well. Greg. Oh, definitely. He's young, he's talented, and he's light. So, you know, he's got, he's got, he's got it all in his side. He's, he's got it all in all. Um, he's got it all in his. Um, in his hand really, he's got it all there. But we've seen Dylan Rush is very canny as well, he's prepared to wait, he's prepared to move and wait for the right time, and as we saw when he, he, he got that superb head kick, yeah. listening to his coach at the same time. Without a doubt, and that is the key, that is the key. At this level, your coach will be the difference between winning and losing. You, you know, ability will get you so far, your coaches are there to help you work the strategy. Again, Musa had, had time in there for a reverse punch, chose to try, go back and try and kick. It's much more difficult, the dividends are better, but sometimes you just got to keep it simple. If you're thinking one point, then mentally you're in a different place, and then you can consolidate it with the bigger points. So sometimes you just got to lick those points and build up your confidence. Well, I, I like what Jordan Thomas said in his interview when he, he's only worried about whoever wins this because, and it's true, he said 32 men, only one takes home the 10K, that's the end of it. <laughs> Whether you go out in that first bout in the opening round, which when he beat Steve Kawaczynski, or you go out in the final, he said it doesn't matter. Nothing. One man takes the check. That's exactly it. That's, it's, uh, it's, it's merciless. It is what it is. You literally have to win. Second's no good. And Musa got back to basics with the hands there. Definitely. Very good. Now he's got the initiative. Now Dylan's, Dylan's got to get the point back. But we've seen him do it before. We've seen him do it before. Dylan, you've seen him get them points back. You know, he's a composed fighter. He knows where he, where he is in the fight. He knows the clock's kicking, ticking down. And Musa knows that he literally has to keep Dylan at arm's length. And again, Dylan looked to his coach and talked to him and saying, you've got to come in now and keep going. And this is what we've seen important is when they focus just on each other and not the referees. That's your chance to score points. That's it, yeah, because then, they, then every opportunity that's available, you can say that you're taking it. Good movement there by Musa, good movement. Dylan maybe needs to just change stance and try and pull because, because uh, Musa's timing's really good. So he might need to pull him out and then go over the top. He's a little bit longer. So he might need to try and do that. But he's changed stance, which is good. Ah, that's good, but just good point. And again, both men continue to work. work <laughs> to Definitely. Work just a little bit, me little bit messy, but good fight by Musa. Really impressed with that. He's been a good fighter there in Dylan. He's really done well in Musa. He's a, he's, a bit of a, he's a bit of a dark horse there.